Well, good morning, good morning, good morning. It is a beautiful day here in Lake Havasu City, Arizona. Yes, it is a good day. It is. And it's especially a good day after we tell you all the great things we have to tell you. <laughs> <laughs> so Debbie has something she wants to show you right quick. Lean over this way. Well, I, I guess uh, a lot of you, I'm sure, know this already, but I went to the store and I bought these. I knew that they weren't lemons because what it said on the tag, but they really look like lemons and I thought the taste would be similar. But what they are is sweet limes. That's what it says right there. Sweet yeah, limes. Yeah, and they're... They're really sweet. We've never seen them before. No, they're like so. It was something like, not like oranges, but they taste very sweet. Very sweet. And they're not a it's, bit sour. It's a sour. strange thing. Yeah, it's a strange thing because you don't think of it for limes. And I thought it would be kind of like lemons. I was going to use in something I was cooking, and it's not sweet. I mean, <laughs> at it's all. not sour. It is sweet. It is. It sweet. is so sweet, not sour. That at was something all. new I learned. Yeah. Right. And an update on Jim's tooth because we had a. That's when that's I put gone. an Instagram on it. Yeah. Put an Instagram post out about it and said that he broke his tooth. We were eating fish and chips again. And he says there's a little rock or something in there. And broke a uh, bit down on it and broke his tooth. So we went to the dentist. Jim doesn't have a... He's had bad experience with dentists. <laughs> that's true. So he really that's hates true. to go to the dentist. But it was broken... You could see that it was broken in half. So the dentist said, well, if we can't, uh, if it's not broken all the way down to the root, we'll put a crown on it. We can do that and save the tooth. But if it's broken all the way down through the root and everything, well, you'll have to, we'll have to pull it. So it was really broken. So he broke it good. He it did a great job on it. So I pulled it out. The doctor did such a great job, and he was—he just loved him so much that um, he said it was the best dentist he had ever there. been to. Lay down. There you go. <laughs> best Dogs. dentist he had ever been to. Dog is just Tri about to turn over the tripod, I think. Yeah, so. she was. Okay, so anyway... Um, now that he has so many teeth missing back there in the back, the dentist said You're, it's going to be really hard on your front teeth trying to chew. So what we've decided to do is stay <laughs> in this area, this area meaning Havasu City, uh, Quartzsite, and probably we'll go down to Yuma, somewhere clo just close enough so we can get back up here in one day for appointments that he needs to have a partial bridge, partial plate, whatever you call it, made for his mouth so he can have more teeth to chew with. So that's what's going on with us right now. Because eating's one of my favorite things. Yeah, because we want him to be able to eat. <laughs> and he has a tendency to chew, do everything he does with vigor. So that is, um, I don't want him to break his front teeth as well. So uh, the doctor said it would protect his teeth more if he had that in there so we're gonna go with that yeah we have been spending some time with phoenix ramblers oh. whose birthday is it today happy birthday to you <laughs> happy birthday to you happy birthday, you. You. Happy happy birthday <laughs> dear sharon happy birthday to you yay, yay. <laughs> This is Sharon. We didn't know it was your birthday. Phoenix Ramblers. That's yeah. right. Phoenix Ramblers. And this is Mr. Childers. That's Mr. Childers right we the, there. We the, we the Bucket Boys. They have the channel, oh, the yes. Phoenix Ramblers. And they are so the fun. The Phoenix Ramblers. Great they are couple. awesome. Great couple. And uh, they've been doing this for a while. So we have they've stuff got to experience. learn from them. They were telling yeah. me all kinds of things. Places we needed to go. Yeah. And truth is, we haven't gone to explore a lot of the places here in Lake Havasu City because we had some cold days, unseasonably cold days here. And we also had, um, on the mountains, when I woke up and looked out my back window, you could see snow on all the mountains out but there. But not cold like some of you are experiencing Oh, here. no, not that cold. We're talking cold like 40s, at night. 30s in, and 40s. In the high 30s. Mm -hmm. 
low 40s. And Which then this, seems warm to you next guys. Next week's all going to be in the 60s, 70s, and even almost to 80. 79, I think, is the high next yeah. Thursday. So, yeah, it's just gradually creeping up and getting warmer. So, that will be nice. And, it uh, will be. Yeah. Yeah, so that's what's going on with us. Anything else you needed to say? Well, I think I have a little clip of Debbie talking about me losing my cameras, but I have to say it was um, a stressful time for me. I've been very careful taking care of my cameras, and we bought a special little fanny pack fanny thing, pack. which I yeah. don't like particularly, no. but I couldn't find a small backpack. And so I w I've been keeping them in that, and I've been really careful to keep up with them. But this morning when we looked for them, I guess they were under some coats hanging up in the front. We couldn't find them. So we went to every restaurant yeah. that we had been to since we've been here. Mm -hmm. And um, so I was quite stressed. Very and we... He was feeling like he had been very irresponsible. Yes. And blaming himself. And, and then, sure enough, when we got back home, I there... walked in the door and there hang, it's hanging right there with the coats. Yes. So. Praise the Lord is what I got to say. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> Absolutely. That's, uh, that's so, not... It wouldn't be a cheap thing to lose. No, 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 no. So we're... We're excited to find our cameras, and that's why we're able to show you uh, this video right here, because we found <laughs> our cameras. Uh, and uh, the good thing is we have been able to use our stove quite a lot, because it's been <laughs> kind of chilly in the morning. We have. We, wake up. we have. So we've been using our stove, and it's wonderful. And we bought some hardwood. Yeah. We can't... The things that we really like are pressed hardwood, and they come from Tractor Supply. But... Track, this tractor supplies out, and they're it's, not going to get any more. And it's seasonal, this year. so they're not getting any more this year. Right. So we just we did to, find some pinion wood, though, which we Jim did, likes the smell. I of. like the smell of the pinion wood when it burns. So we put hardwood in there now, and we just put a little piece of pinion. And uh, so far, I don't think Debbie's even smelled it. I because, haven't been able to smell it. Yeah, <laughs> but uh, I love to smell pinion wood burning. So. Yep. So Maisie is having a good time at the dog park. A basset hound and a bloodhound right there. <laughs> Hi. She's never been to a dog park this size. She wants to play with the border collie, but he's so focused Focus. on his job. Mm hmm. That's exactly right. <laughs>
How are we doing, baby? Being a good girl and keeping the sun off my face, the hat man sold me oh. all this information. Oh, okay. We're in a nice little cantina. It's called the Havelina Cantina. Yeah. And uh, we're just having a little bit of an appetizer here in the middle of the afternoon. And you can see the channel down there. And right here you can see London Bridge. You can get over here so you can see it a little better. One thing I think is really cool down here by the water is that they have all these palm trees and eucalyptus trees and different trees planted down here. And each one of them was planted by a different family member, like a family in memory of somebody. So they'll have a little field right like this. And then they also have, a, they have benches all down here and all the benches too have plates on them that people obviously paid for the bench or something in memory of one of their family members. I just think it's really a beautiful thing. Very peaceful place down here. Yeah, it's it's peaceful. pretty cool. We'll look at this bench here. Gonna read it? Yep, in memory of Lewis Weisberg, a beautiful view, thinking of you. Love your family. A lot of them. It's really beautiful. <laughs> That's my girl. How is it? How is it, baby? It's good, you know. Anytime I have a headache, all I have to do is just have chips and salsa, and then I'm better. So I'm gonna add chips and salsa in quite a while. So. My head was hurting, so that was a good excuse. <laughs> Absolutely. Well, it's a, it, it is a wonderful day, and that is it for now. And we want to tell you guys yes. how much we appreciate you watching our videos. We really do. And we also want to tell you thank you for the thumbs up. And uh, thank you for the comments. We enjoy them. We read every comment. We get we, some of the nicest comments we ever. We get the nicest mm -hmm. comments ever. And we I do. just want to say thank you. It's really nice. And... Uh, it just brightens up my day for sure. And you do too. Mm, well, thank you. <laughs> so goodbye for now.